Philippine team head coach Yang Gia reminded his wards that there's more than just Ricardo Ratliff delivering the goods for Korea in the 2018 Asian Games. Ratliff, a former PBA import now playing as a naturalized player for the reigning Asian Games champions, averaged 23 points and 13 rebounds to power Korea to a three-game sweep of their group preliminaries. But Gao pointed out that six Korean players scored in double figures, with the six foot eight Ratliff finishing with 21 points in their 117 77 thumping of Thailand. So the fiery mentor said they have to put on a solid defensive scheme to pull off an upset against the team that has dealt the Philippines many on court heartbreaks. We just have to prepare hard, said Gao noting the Koreans move so well and remarkably shoot from afar. Korea is getting balance contributions, Giao added. The rain or shine led flipping team and Korea square off in a knockout quarterfinal on Monday, August 27. Size, according to Giao, won't be much of a problem. The best thing about Korea is they've been so patient running their plays. They rely on their ball movement and would wait for an opportunity to break down the defense and attack it, Giao said. In all the three games they played in the group stage matches, Korea didn't shoot below 40% from the rainbow territory. Its best shooting performance was against Thailand, where they hit 47% from the three-point zone, 15 of 32. One of Korea's snipers is Jian Junbiam. Turning 27 in a few days, Jian has been playing great with his three point shooting, hitting five of eight from beyond the arc in their blowout victory over Thailand on his way to finishing with 20 points. He also had a solid showing against Mongolia, where he knocked down four of six trays to end up with 16 markers. Hyoung, a promising six foot one guard, is also a newcomer in the team, but showed a lot of potential following his decent shooting in the first three games. He averaged 12 points per game, including a perfect three for three shooting from beyond the arc against Thailand. Hyo Ilyung and Lee Jungyun, two of the holdovers from the squad that won gold four years ago, remain to be solid contributors. The 6 foot 5 Hio had his best game in his team's 108 73 beatdown of Mongolia, where he finished with 20 points on 6 of 9 shooting from behind the arc. He also had 11 points in their debut win against host Indonesia. Overall, Hio averaged 13 points per game. Lee is also a solid contributor. The 6 foot 3 forward averaged 11.6 points per game.